Happy August and welcome to a new month of pickups. And I've got a lot of pickups this month from a cold wall to different sling bags. This is a good one brought to you by the Karma Shopping Extension, link in the description. Let's check them out. So let's start off with a brand only the tech community would know and I'm glad to be sharing with y'all and that is this tank top from Gorilla Group. And this one is called the SIG panel tank and I got it in a size small and I am 5'7", 156 pounds. Now for those of you guys that don't know Gorilla Group, this is an incredibly affordable technical fashion brand out in Taiwan and they have been featured in a few Hypebeast articles which is always good to see. And yes, when you check out the price of this item for 80 bucks, that's kind of stupid. Okay, but at least you get a pretty dope item. You've got an elongated look which did leave the streetwear scene years ago but has kind of stayed around in the tech community and more higher end looks. It has this grid pattern that would make this a great layering piece that is also moisture wicking and it is without a doubt the most breathable tank that I own. This is the carbon gray colorway which is what I recommend. You're really only going to see all black when it comes to tech wear and that can sometimes make you look like a silhouette but gray is slightly lighter than black which contrasts against the rest of your fits and I really dig it. And Gorilla Group does have your normal tank with the same properties, moisture wicking and all that just without the hem if you guys are into that as well and next up is my favorite pickup of the year and that is the nike gyakuso vaporfly next percent and my oh my are these a beautiful sneaker that literally changed the landscape of the running community nike created such a good running sneaker that it would cut down times and it works so well that these sneakers even got banned well partially banned it's a whole spiel and this one in particular is a collaboration between the gyakuso running brand started by jun takahashi and nike this sneaker was made for running specifically long distance running and clearly i am not a runner but i can appreciate this sneaker for all that it is i mean i do go for runs and sprints and i do a little bit of hit cardio and even with these on you still notice a difference so me being a fashion channel i really like the way these look aesthetically and these sneakers are just super light it's probably the lightest sneaker that i own and i just love the way it looks the vapor weave technology which gives your feet more breathability all that nike technology pumped in here i think it really looks great with tech fits so here you see me in a tech fit you got this y3 overshirt a tank top these cargo pants and then these sneakers just fit so well with the vibe and yes a little unnecessary i'm not going to do a marathon in a tech fit but aesthetically these are so beautiful but if you look at the price tag and you pay this much money for a sneaker you better be using it. Nike still does have these in stock as of the recording of this video, but there's also the normal next percents as well. That's not the collaboration. They are a little bit pricey still. So if I were you, I would tag the sneaker and wait for a sale or a discount with the sponsor of today's video, Karma. Karma, formerly known as Shop Tiger, is my go-to browser extension for all my online shopping. It's basically a browser extension and an app that makes sure you never miss a price drop or a coupon code. It doesn't have to be clothing. I use it for furniture, I use it for technology, things for my office, and of course clothing. Let me show you how it works. All you gotta do is click that link in the description and download the Chrome extension and just start shopping. When you go shopping on one of your favorite sites and you hit a product, this blue box is going to pop up. You can move it up and down to navigate around the page. Basically, whenever you find an item that you like whether it's in stock or out of stock you can tag that item and add it to your own curated list like for me i got technology i got furniture i got streetwear vibes techwear vibes you can make your own list that way your shopping is a lot more organized you know what to wait for however you want to do it and the best part about karma is they're going to email you or send you a push notification if an item restocks or goes on sale that way you can capitalize on that and not miss out on any items like with all the nike acg cargos that i got they were always out of stock but Karma sent me a notification and thanks to Karma, I was able to get those cargo pants. And whenever you go to checkouts, the coupon feature will pop up and then you can click one button. It'll apply a bunch of discount codes, saving you even more money and check me out. I saved mad money on this sexy shoe rack. Thank you, Karma. A place looking nice. And you can now earn Karma cash to your PayPal accounts when shopping with select retail partners. So go ahead and click that link in the description, download the Chrome extension, or you can download the mobile app as well, start saving some money and building that good Karma. Karma, you guys are awesome. Thank you for sponsoring today's video. Let's get back to the pickups. Now, next up, I picked up a few bags. So let's start off with this sling messenger bag that I got from Folk. I mean, there's nothing really too crazy about this bag. This is more for streetwear outfits because all I have really are more tech wear bags. So this is a good addition to my bag collection. I wanted a lighter beige color bag and this was the one. It's very small, which is fine. It's just there to keep the essentials. And beige, just that color, I think pops really well on street fits rather than having black bags all the time. The other bag that I got is this sling bag from CP Company. Some people know about this brand, some people don't. And for those of you guys that don't you guys know stone island right 
Yep, same founder. And founded before Stone Island, actually. CP Company is known for their circular lenses, like the Stone Island patch. And actually, funny story, the, the first time I found out about this brand is actually through jury duty, of all places, right? One of my juror friends was walking around with the hood up and then the lenses across his eyes, which is kind of weird to me. And then he had a, a lens on his wrist area with a watch so he can check the time whenever it was raining. And I thought, oh, that's pretty cool and then i just went back to deliberating <laughs> later that day but the brand always stuck in my head i just couldn't afford it before anyways the sling bag is dyed very nicely kind of has that grungy futuristic look which makes this bag really stand out and why i like it a lot there's two strap pockets in front that you can clip for extra security a long zip to easily access the inside with plenty of other pockets i actually took this bag to hard summer a few weeks ago and i kept all my goods in here everything was safe but the one time i didn't put my phone back in the bag it gets stolen it's a damn shame, Johnny. So if you're bored of sling bags, crossbody bags, or even tote bags, this is a nice switch up. It's a little pricey though. So let's talk about my pickups from a cold wall. Man, I'm just now noticing that this is quite the expensive month, but sometimes you gotta treat yourself. After all, I did hit 100K, thanks to y'all. Y'all are awesome. I'm gonna save that video for another time. What's funny is I actually got these pieces on sale and it still ended up being almost 500 bucks, but I got it for content. Because I wanted to make a video on the difference between cheaper items, you know, more fast fashion or higher end fashion, like this one from a cold wall. I thought that'd be a good video that's coming up in the future. Anyways, I've been holding it up for a while already. This is the Calcite button-up shirt. On sale for half off, lucky me. So I've been eyeing this piece for a while now and I noticed that it was on sale and you know how, karma. And that's off script by the way. You've got a concealed button closure so you don't see any of the buttons. Sleek look. It's a little annoying trying to get it buttoned up but believe it or not, this is a size small. Keep that in mind if you guys are trying to decide on getting this piece. What I dig about this shirt is the printed graphic. It's actually quite dark but it's behind the first layer of the white fabric so it gives it this faded look and it's not really too in your face which is really nice i just styled this simply with some cargo pants and some converses with that folk bag now let the shirt do the talking it's a pretty dope piece now the second item that i got is actually the brush stroke shirt let me tell you this is actually my new favorite shirt now aside from airism shirts there's nothing really special about the shirt other than the design but it is very stretchy and quite comfortable and the cut is a lot more boxy the brush stroke keeps this piece pretty neutral looking but also is loud enough to be a statement piece kills two birds with one stone actually i think i think they've updated it now to feed two birds with one scone anyway this is like striped tees on steroids it's still a neutral piece but stands out quite well now the cut of the shirt is remarkable it's super boxy i got this in a size small as well and yeah this shirt is awesome there's a lot to like about this or that's just how i'm uh justifying the price of the shirt I love it. Let's keep it moving. Next up is the Uniqlo Oversized Airism shirt. You guys know how much I love this shirt. I talk about it all the time. It's $15, best money spent on a shirt. And I got this in the salmon colorway, pretty neutral piece. Really dig this one. Highly recommend these Oversized Airism shirts. Now the next items I got are from Alpha Industries. Big shout out to Alpha Industries. I actually did a photo shoot for them on their Instagram page. You guys can check me out. They sent over these jet cargo pants. These are my new favorite cargo pants to skate in. And I will talk about these pants more in an upcoming video. Just know that i really really like them and they have rip stop fabric so they aren't gonna rip perfect for skating and they sent over this navy bomber jacket this isn't the classic ma1 bomber which i already have three of those and i highly recommend this one has a collar on it that's pretty much the difference few other changes but either way shout out to alpha industries Y'all are awesome. And last but not least is this travel steamer. I already have the Con Air steamer to get wrinkles out of my clothes, but that's really a pain in the ass to travel with. Now this, this is compact and steams almost as well as that Con Air steamer, if not better sometimes. It just depends on the fabric and I highly recommend this. This is only 30 bucks. I'll leave a link in the description. And those are my pickups, fellas. Thank you for a fun journey to 100K. I really appreciate you guys. I'll try and link every item in the description below. Some of these items may be out of stock. And just to be transparent, those are affiliate links so if you guys do make a purchase i do make a small commission which does go back to supporting the channel bless bless you guys are awesome if you guys haven't already follow me on instagram and tiktok at fly with johnny ty and until then stay fly deuces